Moose 3971. Moose 3971. Moose 3971. Moose 3971. Moose 3971. Moose 3971. Got my camera on. I got my mic. I look ridiculous. I am almost sure of it. But that's what vlogging is all about. Looking like a weirdo. So. Oh. Feels good to be out. I'm hoping this is working fairly well. I checked the audio on it the other day and it seemed to come through pretty good without wind. So we'll know more here in a little while. Um, yeah, so it's good to see uh, my Kaylee 7 back out there again. I saw his uh, latest video here about uh, 20 minutes ago, I'd say. And uh, thanks for the shout out, by the way, there, Mike. Uh, I think it's actually my first shot I've ever had on uh, YouTube, so that's, that's pretty cool kind of nice. Uh, on the tire thing, you're right. Uh, I am going with Metzler's, I think, actually. I was thinking they're leaning that way. And I'm changing both the front and the rear because uh, I've already changed the rear tire out on this once before. So they usually, my understanding of it, they usually say to uh, change the front tire every two back tires, uh, which means the second tire on my rear tire would be time for my uh, front tire to be replaced as well. No, it looks fair. I'm gonna keep it for an extra tire, but um, I'm still gonna replace it. Uh, that way, they're both the same tire, you know. I really don't want a Dunlop on the front and a Metzler on the back. Uh, like you said, I uh, I did hear that the Metzlers stick a lot better. I haven't heard much about the Avons uh, that you're talking about. Uh, but I've heard the Metzlers do stick better than the Dunlops. I hear they last possibly even longer depending on how you ride. And I'm a pretty easy rider, so uh, I don't think the tire will be a big problem. This one's lasted on the back of this thing 15, no, 12 or 13,000 maybe miles. I think the rear tires lasted me this time around. I think I changed it two years ago. That ain't bad. Uh, I'm gonna go through and uh, my understanding there are tubes in these because they are spoke, they're laced wheels, so it should be tubes. Get two new tubes, two new tires, and have somebody put them on for me. Give me a chance to uh, make another video on how to change your tires on a Harley. Very carefully, that's my motto, very carefully. Yeah, so feels good to be out. It's a nice cool day. Like Mike said, the cool days are kind of nice. I'm sporting my half helmet with my camera on it. I probably look like the biggest dork alive, but you never know. I probably look like the biggest dork alive before I even put the camera on top of the helmet, so what the hell. Oh, we're going to get a wave. <laughs> yeah. I love the wave. You don't get that people ride cars. Or, well, driving cars. Nobody rides a car. Well, some people might ride a car. I don't know. Oh, nice day. Nice day. I'm hoping the wind ain't too bad on this mic. It's a little windier out than it was the other day. I tested it. So, what else? Um, I got nothing. Uh, absolutely nothing. Well, I'll just keep riding. I'll cut it together. Maybe I'll find something to talk about during the meantime. All right, down here on this road, we're going to go through it now. You see the curve sign coming up right there, 40 miles an hour. These are probably the closest thing we got the twisties around here. Uh, hoping the camera's still running. I can't be sure because, again, it's on top of my helmet. Uh, and I hope the audio's coming through, but I'm going to show you the twisties we got around here with any luck. 
Here we go. Sit back and enjoy. Okay, it'll get better. That wasn't much of anything, I know. That was uh, just a little shot in the dirt, you know, yeah. I was like, what the hell? That wasn't even a curb. Oh, here they come. Here they come. I gotta slow down anyway. This guy in a truck in front of me will probably make me wreck if I don't. Not to mention my tire ain't good enough to stick to this thing on turns. Of course, that's the only turn I got less on the side. Alright, here comes the fun ones. And again, remember, this ain't out west. This is in Michigan. So you gotta start somewhere. I gotta go somewhat slow. I got a guy in a truck in front of me and I don't want to wreck anyways. Okay, here they come. Not a very long stretch, but it is a little bit. Dead animal. Truck's killing the fun. Know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wasn't much of one, but it was a little bit twisted. We got another turn up here, but we're not going to take that. I'm going to pull over and uh, shut this thing down. See how it sounds when I get back to the house. Wish me luck. Talk to you later, folks. To everybody out there on bikes, you guys ride safe out there, all right? That's the last 90 degree turn right there, but we're going to pull in here. A little turn off. Make sure nobody's coming. Okay. Here we go. Eh. Uh, uh.